Hi everyone, welcome to What's Cooking. Today we have breakfast. Who doesn't love breakfast? Mm. And we have a special guest. I mean, we love this person and he's going to make an amazing breakfast. Pastor Rafu! <laughs> this lady is the best thing for my ego because she makes me feel so wonderful, you know, about myself. And I'm, I'm grateful for that. You know, breakfast is breakfast. So breakfast, that's why it's so wonderful for me because it's called breaking the fast because you're supposedly not eating anything all night. So now you're breaking your fast. So today we're going to make um, something that I invented, you know, so I'm going to call it after my name, um, uh, omelette a la Raphael. <laughs> and what makes it so special? We're going to use lamb. So instead of, you could use bacon, you could use Canadian ham, you could use regular ham, you could use anything, but we're going to make the lamb with its fat and bites it very small pieces like that. So that's the first thing we will do. We'll put that with olive oil. Lovely. So Pastor Rafu, yes. what, what's, what's news? What good news do you have? To oh tell my, I'll tell audience? you. Oh, I am so excited. I don't know if you've seen me before and you see me now. I am almost back to what I used to be to weigh when I was 24. Two months, I'm down from, from 40 waist to 36. My goal is to go down to 34. And I'm, I, I lost 27 pounds in, in less. Wow, that's in less, amazing. Yeah, so in less than two months. How did you do that? How did you do Well, I'll tell you, before I say how, what's amazing, it's not just about the looks, but the looks does, does, does matter. <laughs> you know, especially when you go on TV, because TV you know, or YouTube, it makes you look twice your, your size. I have a wonderful friend of mine. She's a member of my church and she's coaching me. She has a, uh, but we don't call it diet, we call it healthy living. Because wow. it's really, it's a matter of choices. And I think that's the best thing, Pastor, because yeah. choices are so important. Life is full of choices. That's right. You know, the most important thing is I chose, I said, this is it, I can't go on like this. I was getting uncomfortable. Uh, my diabetes was getting so bad, you know. I was, I was testing like 134, uh, 145, 145 my sugar level was every morning before breakfast that's not good that's the beauty about you know choosing to live healthy because god has a need for you and your family needs you around and needs you healthy so you could enjoy life and and we thought i love food i mean food is really i mean i i, I live to eat i don't i don't eat to live i live to eat you know but so <laughs> So I never thought I would be able to do this, but I prayed and I, th and I think that's important. I had other people pray for me and I did it. I stopped completely, 100%, no carb, no rice, no pasta, no potato, no bread, and no sugar. That means no fruit. So what do you eat if you don't well, eat bread, you this, don't eat rice? This, 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 this program that I'm on, that I cannot say the name of it, but you could contact me and I could put you in touch with my coach. Uh, her name is Cindy and um, she, she, will, she will coach you like she's coaching me. But uh, you know, Pastor Raphael, our body is a temple. Right? Amen. That's what the Bible says. Yes. And you know, we don't look after the spiritual thing, but we look after the physical things. And, and uh, we need to look after our bodies because, you know, it's no good, like you said, it's no good to anyone if we're dead. Exactly. exactly. Yeah, we're no good to anyone or if we are ill all the time. We're no good for God because yeah. the Bible says, the yeah. dead shall not praise me, That's the right. living praise me. Yes, yes. Yeah. So what's next, Pastor Raffle? All right. Cut the meat for you, you cut the Well, let's put the, the meat, let's put the, let's put, we need to cook the meat first. Yeah, hot pan, olive oil. Add the vegetables. So the everything comes together. Yeah, the tomato, the spring onion, the green and red peppers. Wow. You can put as much or as little you want. Exactly. Mm. 
We will leave the mushroom to add later. Uh, we can but we could add the onions now. Onions. Yeah. The red onions chopped into small pieces. Whoa! Wonderful. Oh my goodness. See, everything God made, He said, it's good. Because all everything here is God's made. No man made any of this. So we're going to add uh, right now one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of uh, nice black pepper. The same thing for cinnamon. Cinnamon, I'm, I'm new to this. You know, cinnamon is good for diabetes, uh, really. I mean, some people I know, they, they eat these cinnamon sticks every day and they drink it. They were, they were really, did not have to go in insulin because of, the, of cinnamon. The paprika is nice coloring and little zest. You gotta kick this dish a little. And now we could add the mushrooms. Thank you. Again, I told you I make a mess. I make noise when I eat. That's I make okay. I make mess That's when okay. I cook. <laughs> oh, look at this. Beautiful. I think um, I'm going to add a little more olive oil to this. In the summer, I love summer because I love mint. When we start growing mint, and this is from the beautiful garden here, the Garden of Eden, we add mint, fresh mint, nice green. Mint is amazing digestive. You know, really, if you have issues, stomach, just boil mint and drink it. So now, I come to my favorite part of this, and that is the cracking of the eggs over this. I don't like to put them in bowls and, and whip them. I like to do it like this. And, and these, these eggs too are fresh eggs from the chicken that grows in the Garden of Eden here oh, yeah. of this uh, you know, wonderful lady. Look, I mean, look she's at got- this. Look at this. So this is called manaish, manushi, uh, zatar. Zatar is thyme, sesame seeds, sumac, olive oil, spread on a on dough, and made in a bakery. So it's called manushi. Manushi is a very popular Lebanese breakfast, especially for kids. Kids loves it. So we go once a week. We buy enough. We put them in the freezer. We take them out, and I put them on open fire like this. So because now they'll smell and they will taste like fresh. New merchandise is available on our store. Come check it out at www.whatstore.org. What Music School is now open with the best prices on the market. 
we have online and in-person programs for all ages. Become the player you've always dreamed of. To claim your free lesson, call now on 617-830-1804. That's 617-830-1804. Or email school at whatmusic.org. To know more, visit whatstudios.org slash school or find us on social media at whatmusicschool.